you know that every single day I find for you some new hidden weapons in Elden Ring and yes I got it. Now I got another one. This little knife can do something just amazing. Pro, look at the effect. And the damage is pretty awesome too. And let me tell you, the attack is long range so just, just look at this. The effect is by it's you jumping in the air and just releasing a ball of green or fire. Bro, I don't even know what is that, a magic spell. Like the blade of gold is the name. It's just you gonna release gold into your enemies, let's call it like that. I'm not sure this looks like gold but definitely, definitely it's something very cool to have. And yes, this meant to be secret, rare and uh, you gonna notice why. Because it's not in a pretty easy to access location but that uh, that's why you have me to show you how you can get the best items in this game this definitely is something really good and also the regular attack i love it now obviously we have to reach the capital probably this is one of the last items not the last one but one of the last uh, items that i'm gonna show you from the capital i just search and search for everything lately in my on my channel and if you don't know my channel, I have a lot of a lot of items, a lot of weapons, armor set and everything else. And now it's time for this awesome item. Make your way to the Leonia of the Lakes and then reach the Grand Lift of Dectus, right over here. Use the medallion, the left and right Dectus medallion. If you don't have that, don't worry, I have a video on my channel, how you can get it. And then use it, uh, go with that lift and then just go on the east side, on the right side to the outer wall phantom tree and then just go a little bit on the north northeast and go to the outer wall battlegrounds now we have to defeat a knight to pass this uh, part definitely have to defeat knight that knight that is guarding this area and go to the east capital rampart then and make your way to the uh, avenue balcony we're gonna start from this location but you have to do something before you can uh, continue you have to defeat two major bosses in order to continue yes i know this is the path first we have to go to the earth tree sanctuary and defeat godfrey the summon spirit of godfrey i already have a video on my channel of how you can be there and also how you can uh, defeat that guy from the west capital rampart it's pretty easy to reach this location earth tree sanctuary defeat that guy from that is standing there then go to the bedside uh, to the queen's bed chamber and then just go to the elder elder elden throne there you have to defeat morgoth again i have a video on my channel how you can defeat that guy and finally we can just go back to the avenue balcony to continue our journey these are the steps i'm gonna explain why it will be a green wall that you cannot pass if you don't defeat margot so be uh, aware of that all the informations are this in this video that's why i want to keep you up to date with every single thing that you have to do to get a certain item when i release a video now just follow me because we have to go to take the to take the that blade and also you're gonna get uh, more items if you like to the path but the blade is the most important thing that we, we have to take Now, here we're gonna find those doors that we have to open. Those are will, will be pretty easy to... You can open them without defeating any boss, so this is not, not something that you cannot pass. I'm gonna show you where is that wall that you cannot pass if you don't defeat Morgoth. Yep, there is a certain, uh, certain wall. That green, green wall that you cannot pass if you don't defeat Morgoth. Morgoth, I hope I pronounced the name right. And why, I don't know why I just get this path, but definitely you can just run, don't stay to fight. You know what, let me, let me just run, I don't want to fight those guys. Now here you have to take this elevator, pull that lever and you're gonna go up, no, down, you're gonna go down or up, no, up. 
up in this one and down in the next one because yes you won't have two elevators and I forgot I'm just an old guy <laughs> okay now the next thing you're gonna see this thing uh, this uh, this place that uh, that gate that you are seeing in front of me yep that is the green wall that I was just talking uh, talk with you about if you are here without defeating Morgoth there will be a green wall that you cannot pass so definitely that's why you have to defeat Morgoth now you're gonna get this beautiful talisman uh, as a bonus then you, you can stay to TV that night but it is not a must you can just outrun that night I know it's on a horse but definitely you can just run 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 I stayed to fight him but I cut this part because it's boring you can, you'll not get anything probably a helm I got by luck but just continue this will be the path that we, I, from time to time in my videos I always like to show you the map so this will be the path that you have to take and this will be the important important elevator that I just told you about and now you're gonna find out why I told you this is a secret item a hidden item that you can easily easily miss in Elden Ring I have to admit I played 435 hours by now and this is my first time when I saw that uh, item and that entrance now go down here do that do exactly like I'm just showing you right now and just take the site of grace takes this site of grace because this are this is the snowfield area and yes I just showed you how you can get to the snow area if you are here for the first time the forbidden lands if you already have this forbidden lands uh, site of grace it's perfect because the one that had uh, has that uh, had that uh, uh, site of grace they can do exactly what you are seeing right now here you have to jump on the elevator just go straight ahead you want to see that entrance that i just showed you you can rewind this video and you can just jump this is a secret room that most of the players don't know about maybe just if you saw it on youtube on or google i don't know or reddit like me i just search things on reddit sometimes but i also like to explore uh, by myself here is gonna be the crazy item right here in this room the knife name is the blade of calling i hope i pronounce it right yeah, it's a blade of calling it's just like a blade a small knife that looks harmless right <laughs> it's not and you can just jump down here you're not gonna die so you can just jump and continue your path or just go ahead and upgrade the knife the knife that you are seeing in this video i upgraded to level 7 because i didn't have enough somber smithing stone i have to get more but i upgraded to level 7 uh, and imagine how much damage you can do to level 10 because that yes that is the the max level that you can upgrade this knife it is a magical knife, so you can upgrade it with some bar smithing stone. The strength, it's low. You have to have six strength, low for everything. So definitely you can use it. Is This is an easy to use uh, weapon. And now just let me show you the skill. For the first time when I just use it, I never knew that this is a ranged uh, skill. You have to, you don't have to be close to your enemies. He's just uh, release a ball of fire just with a pretty uh, good range just look at this pro the animation is perfect uh, in my opinion everything is perfect about this knife i love it you know i love uh, when i have a cool effect I, you know i love when i have uh, something really awesome when i attack someone uh, and also the regular attack it's pretty fast and pretty uh, pretty good we have a pretty decent damage with the regular attack but also we have uh, we have a uh, uh, it's pretty fast yeah two hits and the dog and this crazy zombie dog can be defeated oh nice and when you jump you can dodge some attacks which is pretty awesome because yeah you know I never know how to dodge in this game I'm not perfect and now let's see what it can do against a bird by the way in my opinion it just look it just looks awesome tell me what is your opinion in the comment section because i always read your comments tell me if you knew about this uh, knife this blade it's a blade yes tell me if you knew about this blade tell me what do you think about this blade and definitely i'm gonna see you in the next one i just want to go in a village to defeat some witches it's pretty scary the next part so stay with me but it's also pretty fun 
uh, hit the notification bell because every single day I have a lot of secrets for you in Elden Ring and you never know maybe some days uh, some day we're gonna find something that you don't have uh, in your inventory I just can barely wait to see if you knew about this uh, this blade or this is something that I just helped you with see you really soon have a great day be safe just look at them bro it's like a scary movie the scene that you are seeing right now something like that old witches